all that fuel for these storms to develop. Now, last night we saw flash flooding, but we saw a lot of downbursts or what we call wet microbursts. When you see these strong storms develop, it takes that warm, humid air, mid 90 degree air, pushes it up to 30, 40, 50,000 feet. We get really cold air to develop, even some evaporative cooling, and that air has to come back down. It's going to come crashing to the ground because it's heavy and dense, and it's going to hit the ground and spread out in all directions, and that's what causes most of the storm damage in our area. It's not a tornado. It's straight line wind damage, but these can be devastating. You can see winds in these sometimes 150 miles per hour. This is also why you see so many delays during the summertime because these pop up storms get over an airport. You do not want to fly anywhere near there because that downdraft or microburst will push a plane right into the ground as it's taking off or landing. So that's why you see so many more weather delays in the summer than just about any other time of the year.